Today I'm here at the Tesnatee River in White County, Georgia. I got my wetsuit on. We're gonna do some dredging and possibly some sniping and see how much gold we can get. So smash that like button and let's get to it. Yeah. So you got a little spot where that hooks up to your suit? Yeah. Cool. I mean, this is this air right here. Wow. So we got a Zakeem 4 inch with a gold hog mat. Yeah. You're running all gold hog. Yeah. That's cool. That's cool. All right. Wow, so you got that little stick mounted on there. Let me see.
Let me tell you what, that is way more fun than I thought it was going to be. Man, you can see perfectly underwater. Woo! Man, that was so fun. I hope there's some good gold in that little indicator. Yeah. Uh, let's see what Going I get. On the right time. What did I get on my first uh, significant time on the dredge nozzle? Man, I'll tell you what, dude, that is so much fun. It's awesome. I love it. I love to do it anyway, but even not diving. But when you can see underwater, well, usually, it's amazing. Usually you can see without, I mean, when the water gets way down, I mean, yeah. you can see waist deep. You can see the bottom. You can see the clear of the water. Yeah, yeah. And the nozzle's sucking so hard that it sucks the cloud out of the out of the hole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you, it's not getting cloudy. Right. It's yeah. just sucking the cloud out. Exactly. When you ain't got as much current, you know, much water flow. So yeah, it yeah. Just suck, it'll suck that cloud out right where you can see it. That ain't bad. Yeah. Let me see if I can. Nice. I've been wanting to find some, um, some, um, Wow. Yep, that's some decent gold right there for 20 right. minutes for the uh, the little uh, indicator moss. Come out of there. That was under there. Just came out of that. Right there, yeah. All right. Here, let me look and see. You didn't let it. You didn't really let it flush at all. Yeah, I did. You did. You let it flush a little bit, but the when the rubber mats there, it kind of holds everything back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look behind him. Did we see any giant pickers in here? No, don't see any. Oh, look, it's gold. I mean, my God. There you go. Wow. Nice. Nice, nice. It's all back here, gold is. Here, can you pick it up? Try to pick it up. I don't think so. You can, it's a picker. Yep, it's a picker. That's definitely a picker. Yep. The GoPro doesn't pick it up as good as the other camera, but wow, it's a pretty piece of gold. Sweet. You found the nut right here? Yeah. All right. So yeah, we're going to test these tailings because we found a steel nut just sitting on top. And so we want to make sure uh, we're not losing a bunch of gold out of the back of this dredge here. All right, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully there's not a single speck in here. Cause that would be a shame. Well, yeah, see that? There's gold right there. Yeah. It's like a little piece of wire gold right there. See that? Mm-hmm. We're missing it. A little. Yeah. Here, let me check it carefully here. Yeah, I think. I think that's it. So it's just that one piece there. I see it. It's almost like wire gold. So lost a little bit, but I mean that's not crazy. Mm -mm. At least we got like ten colors it. there. Yeah, that treasure is gonna lose a little. came home with a little bit of gold but he's gonna take some pictures and send me what he got but yeah this is just from the little indicator mat from about 10 minutes of running plus some lead well that was really awesome my first time dredging and uh 
I can't wait to do that some more. But you might notice if you look down below the video that I have a merch store. So please go check that out. I got hats and coffee cups and shirts and all kinds of stuff. And it supports the channel if you buy something. So I'd really appreciate that. Also, if you'll follow me on Rumble and join my Patreon, subscribe to the channel and smash that like button. All those links are in the description. Now, see you next time.